The Golden State Warriors have an embarrassment of riches. Not only do they have a team that should be the favorite for next year's title, but they also have an excellent young core that will help to extend their dynasty. One of the Warriors' most valuable young pieces is Jonathan Kaminga. After getting taken with the 7th pick in last year's draft, Kaminga had a very up and down rookie year and found himself in the G League, but by February Kaminga started to get meaningful minutes and he was also producing. Now Kaminga will have a chance to earn a much bigger role next season. This video is going to break down Kaminga's game and explain why he has a chance to be a legit star. But before we continue, I'm trying to hit 20,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So if you enjoy the content, drop a like on the video and hit that subscribe button. Now on with the video. Kaminga has a rare combination of agility, strength, size, and athleticism. Thanks to those physical gifts, he's a terrific finisher. He's a great lob target, whether it's off cuts to the basket or running hard in transition. He's also pretty fast so he can easily drive by defenders for powerful finishes at the rim. Already we're starting to see defenders get out of the way to avoid getting posterized by Kaminga. In his rookie season, Kaminga shot 71% within 5 feet of the basket, which is extremely good. To put in perspective how efficient that is, LeBron shot 73% within 5 feet of the basket last year, and LeBron is one of the best drivers in the league. It's not every day you see a teenager who's this dominant around the rim. As he continues to develop his game, Kaminga will become a nearly unstoppable paint presence. Kaminga also has immense potential on the defensive end. He's got the size and athleticism, but he also plays with a lot of effort, which makes him a great man-to-man -man defender. Throughout last season, the Warriors would put Kaminga on the other team's best player, and he more than held his own. The fact that Kaminga can guard all-stars like DeMar DeRozan as just a first-year player shows that his defensive upside is off the chain, and because of his excellent lateral quickness, he's a versatile defender that can not only defend big wings, but also be switched on to fast guards. With his ability to guard this well at just 19 years old, there's no question that Kaminga can eventually become an elite defender. But while Kaminga has shown immense potential on both ends of the floor, he still has a lot of areas of his game that he needs to improve on. For starters, he needs to become a better shooter. On the season, Kaminga shot just 33% from three-point range and 68% from the free throw line. Those are pretty poor shooting percentages, but Kaminga's shooting did improve as the season went on. The Warriors coaching staff challenged Kaminga to be a better shooter, and in his last 25 games of the regular season, he shot a solid 36% from downtown and 73% from the free throw line. If Kaminga could shoot this well next season, it'll make him an even better slasher because defenders will have to play on his D on him, and a better free throw percentage would improve his scoring average. He draws a lot of contact on his drives and gets to the free throw line a lot, attempting 6 free throw attempts per 36 minutes last year. A higher free throw percentage would not only increase his points per game, but also make him a lot more efficient. He also needs to improve as a decision maker with the rock. While he can make some excellent passes, he tends to turn the ball over too much, which is why he averaged more turnovers per game than assists per game in his rookie year. But that's an area that will improve with experience and more ball handling opportunities. Overall, Kaminga is far from a finished product, but he's got an incredible work ethic. And he's also known as a fierce competitor, which is going to help him to maximize his potential. The Golden State Warriors have also done a great job of putting Kaminga in position for success by bringing him along slowly and allowing him to learn from the veterans on the team. Going into next season, Kaminga should be a part of the Warriors' second unit and he'll have a legit chance to carve out a big role. With Kaminga, the Warriors could soon have a blossoming superstar on their hands that'll help them to extend their dynasty into the next decade. But anyway guys, that's going to be it for me. Do you think Kaminga is a future all-star for the Warriors? Tell me in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like on it and hit that subscribe button and click this video to see a deep analysis of the entire Warriors roster headed into training camp. 